Okay, I'm gonna go to another movie. Over here at the Regal, this one's gonna be at, uh, or this one's gonna be the new Demon Slayer thing that's gonna be in the theater. I can't pronounce the subtitle, so I'll just make sure it's listed correctly. But, uh, yeah, it's another Demon Slayer thing, so I bet it's gonna be loud and bloody. But, uh, <laughs> so when I get back out to the car, I'll let you know what I thought about it. I go to the movies. Who would have thought? So, here's my opinions. My opinions don't matter. Your opinions don't matter. What? We just put our opinions on the internet. It's what we do. As a culture. No one knows why we do it, but we can't seem to stop. So, for what it's worth, I'm THE Joshua Lukoku, and these are mine. A Demon Slayer. Uh, the new one that's in theaters. <laughs> I can't pronounce that subtitle. Uh, you know, yeah, but do, but do, but do, but do, but do, but do. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, yeah, I think this is the third one they've put in the theaters. But, uh, so, my friend Joey, he told me about how this is actually working here. So, they're, like, showing, like, the last episode of the, the, the season, and then a couple episodes of the next season, or something like that, and that's what these things are. So... Yeah, I saw the one where they were on the train. I saw the one where they were in the in the town that was on fire. And then they were, you know, in, in some kind of castle. <laughs> you know, so this one, it starts out where they're, they're chasing the guy with the, 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 the big cancerous tumor on his forehead. The demon with the big cancerous tumor on his forehead <laughs> through the woods, and they get into a field off a cliff, sort of thing. So that's what that that first part of it was. So the thing about the way they do this, with it being like the climax of one season and then, then the setup to the next season, is that the movie theater going experience is very uh, uneven and lopsided because you have all the action and all the craziness and everything is at the beginning and then everything else is seems like <laughs> you know it's just a, a step down <laughs> you know so i mean the first part it was intense and dramatic and emotional and uh, even though i don't really know what's going on because i don't watch this show Right, I never watched any of the show, and I know if there's like uh, some anime books that it's based on, I never like read any of that or seen any of that or anything. So <clears throat> all I know is what they kind of show me in like flashback stuff and stuff like that, and stuff from the previous. Now that I've seen a couple from the previous things, you know, but there's like big jumps in what's happening, you know. Now the now the girl with the cannoli in her mouth, demon girl, now, now she has like a grown-up form. She's got tattoos on her, on her boobies and stuff like that. I was like, whoa, thought she was a little, thought she was supposed to be a little girl. <laughs> so she had like a grown-up state, but then she kind of goes back to the, well, anyway, I don't want to do like uh, spoilers and stuff like that, but, <clears throat> and there were some other characters that are introduced in this one. Like there's some girl with some butter, she has a butterfly on her head, and uh, I like her, and there's some girl who's got <clears throat> real colorful hair, and you know, she's fighting some sort of dragon, <laughs> and that sort of thing. And the dude with the fire on his head, he kind of shows up later, and but unfortunately, this, this, this one, it does, doesn't have as much of my favorite character. My favorite character is obviously Pighead Man, <laughs> that's what I call him. Uh, he has an actual name, but I don't know. He's this pig head man, and he acts he acts crazy. <laughs> He's my favorite character. He kind of shows up a little later, but but in, in one of the parts of the next season or whatever, however this works. But uh, yeah. So <laughs> so uh, the, the first part of it was awesome, you know, and it was. It was, uh, you know, there's a whole lot of just screaming and lots of 
lots of crazy colors and everything happening. It's like, I have to chop off this guy's head, you know, which is always what they're trying to do. <laughs> you know, he's like, oh, but I have an injury to my leg. I cannot run as fast because he's running away through the through the woods. <laughs> These guys are trying to catch him. But, but uh, yeah, so, I mean, the art style, I mean, it, it's pretty cool. You know, they do a bunch of cool visuals and stuff like that. Their characters are looking pretty beat up at this point. <laughs> you know, they're looking rough. <laughs> and uh, it's kind of gory, you know, all that sort of stuff. But, uh, yeah. So, I mean, the art, it's, it's still as good as, as the other ones, you know. It's like, it's really well done. Then every once in a while they're like, okay, now we're going to be goofy anime, you know, and they'll have people just going, ha, 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 you know, <laughs> do weird stuff. Then other, then other times it's like real detailed and all sorts of other things. But, so, I mean, I, I could say I watched this one. <laughs> I still think my favorite one was the one that was on the train, but I think that one was an actual movie. Uh, all by itself but whereas this one and the one i saw before was episodes strung together but yeah so but there's a new demon slayer thing in the theater you can go check it out yeah, those are my first thoughts and opinions after seeing the new demon slayer thing that's in the theater <laughs> uh yeah i'm throwing those thoughts and opinions up on the thoughts and opinions pile they'll soon be buried by everybody else's thoughts and opinions you know go ahead and tell me your thoughts and opinions put them in the comment section uh, don't forget to, um, you know, don't forget to like, subscribe, ring the notification bell, don't forget to feed your cat, and, uh, always use sunscreen, especially if you're a demon lady. <laughs>